Hi everyone, thank you so much for coming back to my channel. Today my hair is in waves. I put some curls in it, but I basically blew up my hair with the new pressed collection from Mizani. They sent me the entire package. I kind of want to do an unboxing with you, show you exactly how the products work, my first impressions, first time touching, using the products, and give you everything on camera and actually blow my hair out for you. Um, I did this style, so these are my finished results. If you wanna see how I got these, please keep watching. Thank you so much. Please like, subscribe, comment if you like this content. I appreciate you. My big Mazzani box, and we are gonna open it up and see what is inside. So. Here it is, um, press agent, big box. All right, so <laughs> I've got some stickers here, which are really cute. It says press agent, hashtag texture love, just very cute stickers, love it. And then I've got a shampoo gonna read off just the front part for you it says thermal smoothing sulfate free shampoo for all texture types with agave extract argan oil and uv filter awesome and i'm supposed to massa massage this into wet hair lather and rinse so basically just a regular uh shampoo it says that it's going to remove product buildup and leave hair moisturized which is what i really need it also says that it's sulfate free again so a shampoo then i've got a conditioner here i'm gonna read this thermal smoothing sulfate free conditioner for all texture types same thing as the other one with agave extract argan oil and uv filter and then you know use this after your shampoo um and it's supposed to glide through tangles soften hair and then i have what looks like a raincoat styling cream and it says heat protection up to 450 degrees that's very good and it says that you basically use this for the bow try and silk press perfection. And then here is the last product, which is called a raincoat styling serum. And this also has heat protection up to 450 degrees. You can add this to damp or wet hair and then straighten. Okay, so I guess we use both of these and then straighten. All right, so I'm going to wet my hair, come back, we're gonna apply the shampoo and then go on with the process. Here's my shampoo. I'm just gonna put a generous amount. It has a very subtle scent and I can't even tell what it is. Oh, it definitely lathers, you guys. It lathers. Wow. Yes, it does lather a lot. But it's sulfate free. Love that. Love a shampoo that lathers, but it's sulfate free. My hair is clean with that shampoo and I will say it has that squeaky clean feeling and 
it definitely is like it reminds me of the sulfate shampoo for sure all right i'm gonna move on to the conditioner this has the same exact smell where it's definitely not overpowering so if you're sensitive to you know any types of scents or anything like that this scent is very very light all right so this conditioner is very thick well i'm not gonna say very thick because i'm using the grow gorgeous one right now and that one is incredibly thick um this one is like a level below that one but it's still pretty thick I'm gonna detangle my hair with the conditioner in there and kind of let you know, you know, like how the slip is and so forth. So, definitely feels moisturizing. I don't know if you can tell as well when a conditioner is moisturizing. It just feels like it's like your hair seeps into it. And I also think that the Shampoo has something to do with that because once you have a clean slate, it's easier for your hair to absorb new nutrients or whatever other product you're putting onto your hair. Okay, so far doing one side, the slip is pretty good. Um, you guys saw that. It didn't take me long at all to get through whatever like knots or anything I had in my hair and it's super shiny and it feels good. Like you can even see that. Okay, so that's, that's nice. dried and here is how it looks it's looking clean moisturized shampoo sh condition so now I'm gonna move on to the raincoat styling cream and I am going to put you know I like to when I'm doing my blowouts I don't want to put too much product but I don't want to put too little so that my hair is protected but at the same time you know I don't want it to be weighed down because one thing you don't want is a blowout that's weighed down so for my length of hair I feel like that was perfect that I just put in there
finished results. I like them. First impressions, I would say that the products were easy to use. They smell great for sure. Um, but I would say that as soon as I used them, that I felt as though, and this might be user error, but in the front of my hair, it was greasy rather than the back of my hair. The back of my hair feels soft and nice. I just put some curls in them. Um, but really good blowout. You know, it looks nice very similar to what I would get in a salon. So I would, you know, say that my first impressions were mostly good. Thank you so much for watching. This is not a review of these products, but this is my first impression. If you'd like me to do a review on one product of this line, let me know and I will. As you know, my reviews are very detailed based on ingredients and whether or not the marketing lives up to what you actually get.